All right, alternate exterior. So for alternate exterior, we took notes, we did the example, and now at the bottom, I'm gonna have you write the notes. If the lines are parallel, alternate exterior, alternate exterior. If the lines are parallel, alternate exterior angles, are congruent. Yep, yeah, this is on page 21. We just did alternate interior. This is page 21, alternate exterior. Okay, this will be up here for a few more minutes. If you're watching the video, then you can just click pause and write the notes. You got about 30 seconds if you're watching it live. seconds. Have you noticed that all of them say if the lines are parallel then something? That's our conditional statement. 10 seconds. Okay, turn the page please, and we're going to go to page 22. We already have an example. This is from alternate interior example. So what I'm going to have you do is if you have not taken the notes, I'm going to have you draw this. Can you let them in? Um, and you can click pause on the video, but it's in the video right before this one. So for this example, it's going to tell you that angle is equal to 95 and it's going to say find angle 1. Please copy that for page 22. Now again like I said we're doing this example that's from the previous video if you have not thank you if you have not already watched it go watch that one first or you can click pause while you draw it. Okay, we're going to find the measure of angle 1. Now, they told me angle 5 already. Kashini, can you tell me what we write if... Give me just a minute and I'll write it. Where's my orange marker? Here it is. Okay, they already gave me this in the problem. So, I'm going to write it right here. Angle 5 equals to 95. Kashini, um, what I was asking was, how, what do we write under it if it's in the problem? That the reason that I know this is in the problem. Exactly, you're right, given. Now, what I'm going to do, back up here, erp, erp, angle 1 and angle 5. Angle 1 and angle 5. So do you see how they make the X? Do you see that? So that means that they're both on the outside. Do you remember when we would color in the inside? Okay, 1 and 5 are make an X alternate. They're both on the outside, so they're alternate exterior. Now, we said if the lines are parallel, if the lines are parallel, then they would be congruent. That's what we wrote on page 21, right before we did 22. So because it tells me right there the lines are parallel, that means angle 5 and angle 1 are congruent. Angle 1, which you can't see, angle 1 is equal to angle 5. Why? Because the lines are parallel. They're equal because the lines are parallel. So because they're the same, Angle 1 is also equal to 95. And then I would write that they're Y because they're alternate interior, exterior, exterior. And they're only equal because the lines are parallel. That's why. The lines are parallel. That means that they are equal to each other. <laughs> 